A story that's uh, getting some traction over here is one that involves, uh, of course, our wonderful Princess of Wales, Princess Catherine, and of course, the half-sister of Meghan Markle, Samantha Markle. But how real is this story? As ever, let me explain. Morning, lovely to see you today in the very heart of London. I hope you're keeping well, whatever you're doing. And of course, do take care of yourselves out there. I know you've all been very kind regarding, of course, uh, the recent phone snatching and you're very sweet. Trust me, I can look after myself. The bottom line is you just can't always see pickpockets, can you? No, that's the thing. And I would advise that more so than ever. If you're out shopping, ladies, keep your eye on your handbag. I'm watching so many people now and they're so distracted and you think it would just take literally seconds for somebody to take their product. Do you know what I'm saying? Look out for yourselves. So this particular story appertaining, of course, Catherine, the Princess of Wales, and of course, the half-sister of Meghan Markle, Samantha. Now, as we all know, Samantha's case was thrown out and um, a lot of people were rather upset by this. Now, my personal thoughts and I think I voiced these previously is this you know it was very strange to see Samantha's lawyer being interviewed on digital platforms I often thought that you know really less is more perhaps silence may have had some weight in that obviously he would know the full legal recourse and no doubt would know exactly whether he thought this was uh, detrimental or not but then of course we had Samantha popping up on television quite a lot you know giving interviews regarding her sister and you know that's her prerogative but I would have thought really that someone should have said look you know keep quiet until this has come to fruition now as we know sadly for her it's been thrown out but apparently now she wants to request all in the goodness of time of course a witness statement from Catherine Princess of Wales uh, known of course to many people around the world and in some of the file documents as Kate Middleton strange indeed but what I find odd about this is that you know anybody knows who works in the media that this is a non story there is no way that Catherine the Princess of Wales would intervene on such a you know private family matter and indeed what exactly witness statements could possibly she could throw into uh, the equation it just simply doesn't make sense what I would surmise with this particular story is it gets uh, you know once again a bit of credence going against it and more importantly puts it back in the media spotlight here's though the plan Markle plans to ask Catherine, the Princess of Wales, for a witness statement as she officially files appeal against the judge's dismissal of her defamation case against her half-sister, Meghan Markle. Her recovery, of course, Samantha says, is a priority, but at some point she would definitely like to request this. Samantha Markle's legal team will ask the Princess of Wales for a witness statement as the estranged half-sister of Meghan attempts to continue her defamation lawsuit against the Duchess of Sussex in a Florida court. It was earlier reported that Samantha's lawyer, Peter Tickting, had filed an appeal to Judge Charlene Edwards Honeywell's March ruling that Meghan's comments made during the couple's 2021 interview with Oprah Winfrey did not merit defamation. The suit was dismissed without prejudice, meaning that it simply cannot be refiled. So really the bottom line is that they're hoping something could come from, of course, the Princess of Wales. I would suggest looking a little bit further afield. There are other people that worked alongside Meghan, literally for her short tenure over here in the British monarchy. Perhaps they would be more willing to come forward with a witness statement. But as I said, I would surmise is that this particular lawyer is looking for a name, box office, a big draw, to get some traction towards the case. It simply won't happen, it never would happen, and certainly both the Prince and Princess of Wales have drawn a line under their association with Meghan Markle, assisting or not. So as far as Samantha and her lawyer are concerned, quite frankly, it is back to the drawing board. Neil Sean in the very heart of London.